Someone has been holding back from speaking about you to their friends. You know why? Because they've been speaking way too much. And the truth is they're afraid of their judgment. Some of you have been on and off with this person, so they don't really want to speak about it. And others, this is just someone who is bit out of their comfort zone, out of their, uh, let's say, um, regular territory. Let's find out a bit more. Page of Swords, Ten of Cups, the Five of Pentacles, and the Two of Pentacles. We have someone here who's very considerate with their money. They know what they put their money in. So they're very afraid, like gifting to people whom they don't really care about. So they're very considerate when it comes to where they spend their money at. They're very much into family though. When it comes to spending, when it comes to taking care of someone, they really care about doing that with their family. And even though they count their money pieces by pieces and they're afraid to spend or overspend, when it comes to actually taking care of their family, they are okay with juggling multiple responsibilities. They're okay with <clears throat> spending or even overspending on their families. You might have been going out together and being very thrifty together. I'm hearing that song, you know, you know that song? We have the High Priestess, the Fool, and the Queen of Wands. Um, this person has a lot of attraction towards you, but it's more like an attraction that they don't understand. It's very much above them. They don't know why are they so attracted to you. There's so much mystery around you. And it's not just that. You guys have been speaking about them, about things that they almost never explored. And this is someone who is into things. This is someone who is interested in different things. This is someone who likes to study a little bit, who likes to read a little bit. So they feel that it's really fun to have you around because you bring a lot of good fortune and you've showed them a whole different side of the world. And this is really good fortune. They find that they had a lot of opportunity because of you, thanks to you. And with the Queen of Wands and the Fool, it's all about a new opportunity. You are standing out in the crowd. You are the one that is pushing them out of their boundaries and you're also taking them in a risky adventure when it comes to being around you. It's always fun and, ha and exciting. We have the Three of Wands, the Emperor, and the eight of pentacles you guys some of you guys are working with this person and this person has been very serious when it comes to being around you yes they are i'm hearing very serious especially when there are other people if there are other colleagues and people maybe like a boss or something they would be very serious and very um let's say to the point when they speak to you they're not very much talkative when it comes to uh their work ethics they're very serious about it so you guys are wondering is this person interested in that sense are they going to take a chance with you are going to make a move here when it comes to you know taking you out asking you on a date i see some of you here have been exploring that already Yes, two of cups. I am seeing that this person would be interested and they're really trying to get into, um, I'm hearing your energy field. So they're very much curious about the fact that you, um, you're so different. You're unique. Four of pentacles. We have the ten of wands and the judgment. So you guys know that this person has multiple responsibilities and you're not pushing them out of their boundaries, but they want to. They're going to want to take a chance. They're going to want to actually come out of their boundaries. Four of cups. Yes. So you felt that maybe this person is uh, not into you or they could be a little bit bored with their energy, especially if you've noticed that they're not speaking to you so much. Page of cups. But you're going to notice that this person is going to come and offer you something. I want to know what is this offer about? What is this offer about? We have the page of wands, death in reverse, and the magician. This is definitely an offer of starting uh, to explore each other. Like maybe it is, it could be a date for some of you with the page of wands. Look at this. Maybe you guys are going to go bowling or something, or you're going to go um, have fun uh, with your rollerblades. I don't know, but there's definitely a movement here with the death in reverse if you thought that this person is gonna let you go or if you thought that this person is not actually gonna be taking a chance you're wrong actually this person is thinking about manifesting this chance with you with the king of cups this is definitely the kind of person who's not going to overshare when it comes to their feelings their emotions and it's not just with you this is who they are 
justice yes so expect for them to actually make this right because they want to make this right with you but they could be a little bit worried about whatever contract you have you have together so if it's a boss definitely this person is afraid and um, they might not want to make a move right away a page of cups but you're going to see that this person slowly as soon as they start getting to know you and trusting you they're going to want to actually take a step okay follow me for part two